What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. I have not posted a video in like two weeks and that's my bad. Um, but I've been putting things together for this video for a while and I was going to film it like last week but one of my packages got stuck at the airport because of COVID for two weeks. So I had to wait until that package came in and I literally just got it today. Um, and then the week before that, it was my birthday and I was gonna post a birthday vlog but I ended up not really getting any footage. So I had to skip that week too. And there's been a lot going on so let's just pretend like the last two weeks didn't happen. And yeah, so I'm really excited about this video because I love getting new clothes and I have gone out of my comfort zone of literally plain clothes. I have always worn such plain things. And so I decided to go very out of my comfort zone and I'm gonna show you what I got. So I'm gonna like show you what I have and then there's also gonna be like clips of me trying everything on and I'm gonna go by brand. So yeah, let's get started. So the first brand I'm going to be showing you is Pretty Little Thing. I got three things from there. Actually, I got four, but I'm not showing you one because literally I wore it and it ripped. I was upset, but whatever, it's fine. So the first thing I got from there was a bathing suit. I got this bikini right here and it doesn't have like anything to adjust how tight it is. Um, but it does have a, no, it doesn't have adjustables on the straps either, so it's not adjustable at all. So you just gotta pick your size and that's what you get. Um, in the try-on, I did not try on the bottoms because they're very cheeky. I'm gonna go get those to show you, but um, I didn't wanna put my booty out on the internet for everybody to see, so I'm just, I paired it with a pair of jeans. These are the bottoms from the front and these are them from the back, so they're definitely cheeky. Um, but I really like the material and yeah, they're stretchy, super cute. And then the next thing that I got from Pretty Little Thing, super, super cute cropped t white tank and it has like a little tie in the front. Um, it's not stretchy like at all. So it's really hard to get off because the back comes up so high and the tie gets tighter and all that stuff so it's super cute like fun active or just casual crop top i really love that then the next thing from pretty little thing is this really cute black flowy crop top and it has the illusion that it ties in the front but really it's like if you untie it, it's still just gonna be there the tie is just kind of for looks, I guess. Um, pretty see-through, as you can tell, but once you have it on, it's not really see-through at all. Definitely very loose, so I pair it with a bralette so that the chichis aren't falling out. Um, but I love it. I love how flowy it is, and it's like a crop top, but not like super tight. So, I love it. Okay, so that was all the things for Pretty Little Thing. The next brand I'm gonna show you is Nasty Gal. And this is the package that took two and a half weeks at the airport, but it's fine. We got it today. And honestly, this is my favorite outfit, I think. Yeah, I only got two things from there. I got a pair of pants and a shirt. So here are the pair of pants. Like I said, very out of my like comfort zone. These are definitely out of my comfort zone. Um, plaid pants, little button tie. Um, I don't know why I said tie, a little button. Um, the only thing I don't like about these is that it doesn't have pockets. But other than that, like they fit you really well. Like they accentuate your curves, but they're not uncomfortable at the same time. Like they're super comfortable. They're not very thick, so they move with you. Definitely recommend. And then the shirt that I got with it, I'm actually wearing. So it's just like this cute tank crop top. Um, the straps are very elastic. So 
they kind of just fall off but we can work with it it's fine it's still really cute um let's see the next brand I got is white fox and Sarah's day collaboration and I just got the bathing suit that she came out with because I was obsessed and I'm not gonna lie I got a size too small but I was going off of her size chart and I guess it's just not a very good size chart to go off of and it's not her fault it's Australian to US sizes it's really confusing but um, I got a small and I should have gotten a medium um, but she wore an extra small and so I thought I would be like a size above her but I made it work it's not that bad um, they have these like little seashell things if you can see that that's on the end of the ties and it crosses in the back it's super cute it's a really stretchy material again I did not wear the bottoms um, because very cheeky again didn't want my butt out there on the internet for everybody to see but here are the bottoms and they're the same material as the top very cheap very hit very stretchy also very cheeky this is the back there is a seam that goes down the middle um, I don't I didn't notice it when I did put them on so I doubt it's a big deal but I love how stretchy they are and you can wear them high-waisted or right on the hip like that either way super cute love the color love Sarah thank you to my boyfriend for getting me those for my birthday the next brand I have is another Australian brand and I'm shocked but I actually got all of the sizing pretty on point um, I've ordered from this brand before it is Mira boutique I think that's how you say it not 100% sure it's M-U-R-A but I'm pretty sure it's Mira um, so the first thing I got from there is these cute little shorts and I love the way these fit like it the way it fits on your waist to your hips it's super cute accentuates all that but it does a little a little number on your downstairs area if you look right here you can kind of tell it like I don't know just the way that that is is weird to me and it kind of does a weird thing when you have it on as you can see I'm trying on I keep picking at it because it looks funny I guess it's just because of the stripes I'm not sure but it's like a crochet material pretty stretchy but super 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 comfortable um, if it wasn't for like the little weird bunching at the bottom um, I would love those I do love those but that's the only downside and then the next thing are these other pair of shorts. Um, I thought they were going to be more similar to the other pair, but they're not. They're very different. They're very wide-legged and very flowy. Um, very stretchy and kind of see-through, but when you have it on, it's not that bad. The only thing about these is they kind of like flip up in the back and they don't really cover my butt all the way. And so like I kind of can't wear them as high-waisted as I would like to because of that but it's still really cute um it would be a cute like swimsuit cover up if you're going to the beach because if you're in a swimsuit and your butt's showing anyway who cares if your butt's showing in the shorts that you're wearing to cover up your swimsuit you know but I don't know it's not that bad but I just can't wear them as high-waisted I would prefer but I'll make it work because they're cute and they're comfortable the next thing from this brand I think, yeah, I'm, this is for sure my favorite item from Mira. It's these super, super, super cute shorts. No, pants. These are definitely pants. Let me just tie these really quick. They're super flowy and floral, high-waisted. Um, they're kind of see-through, but again, when you have it on, it's not that bad because it's just like a very flowy material and I love them when you have them on the legs are so wide it kind of looks like you're just wearing a skirt but they're so comfortable so flowy perfect for summer like if you want to wear pants if you didn't shave or whatever you got a bad sunburn on your legs and you want to wear pants but you don't want to be super hot these pants are perfect and I'm in love with them they might be the pants that I wear all summer who knows we'll see love them to death Okay, so the next thing I got from Mira is this super cute 
crochet crop top. It's not super cropped, but um, definitely kind of cropped and definitely see-through because there are very big holes in the crochet, so definitely gotta wear something under it um, or don't. Totally up to you, but for me, I'm gonna wear something under it. And it has really cool detail at the bottom. I just love the way the crochet looks and it looks very neon but like once you put it on you pair it with some like denim jeans or shorts it doesn't look like I'm an 11 year old middle schooler it's super like beachy fun summer vibes you know super cute super comfortable I'm just really scared that after I wash this it's gonna get ruined because of the crochet but it feels like really good quality and like it would hold up so let's hope for the best the last thing that I got, um, no, it's not the last thing. The next thing that I got from Mira is this other shirt. And it's not the material that I was expecting. It's just like this super stretchy material. It's, it's that thing that it's like supposed to fit everybody's boobs or something. I don't know. They used to make those shirts that's like one size fits all and it was this type of deal. Um, but it's really stretchy. It's kind of like that stretchy mesh. I don't know if... I can get it to show not sure if you can tell but it's like a really stretchy mesh it's like floof at the bottom and the only thing about this shirt is that these little ties on the shoulders like when they come undone they come undone so putting this on by myself was was kind of hard not gonna lie kind of hard but I made it work and it's super cute pretty comfortable um yeah we like it okay now the last thing that i got is um a dress super cute long dress got a little tie in the front i don't even know what this print is but it's really cute and it has like little ruffles um on the way down and then it has a slit on the right side but it's literally on the side of your leg um but I love it and the back has a really stretchy part for putting it on so it doesn't have like a zipper or buttons or anything like that but I really like it and the straps are adjustable super cute for summertime if you're going to a vacation or like do a wedding or any of that fun stuff super super cute I forgot the last brand that I actually have is um, the mint julep boutique um, I just got this a long time ago. I got it for my birthday, but then quarantine happened and I couldn't wear it on my birthday. So that's fun. Um, but it's this super cute wrap dress and it has like a little hole that you put the string through and wrap it and tie it in the back. Super cute brown with polka dots. It has, um, elastic around the wrists and ruffles around the edges gives a super cute look super elegant super fun at the same time really really cute wish i could have worn it on birthday but thanks corona and i'm so excited to wear all of these things that's why i'm already wearing this shirt because i love getting new clothes cannot stress that enough it's like an addiction but i never buy new clothes so i don't know i love just going online and putting things in my cart and then i never check them out but I actually bought things for once and I'm very proud of myself and I'm very excited about all of these things because I love new clothes. But yeah, I'm going to stop talking about how much I love new clothes and get to the end of this video. I'm going to try and link everything down below, but that dress I got a long time ago, so I'm not sure if it's going to be on their website anymore and some of this stuff may be gone because everybody was having really good sales so it could be sold out but I'm gonna try and link everything down below if I couldn't link it I'll say so in the description but yeah that is everything for my little clothing haul for springtime and summertime I hope you guys enjoyed thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video bye